Hello, I'm Mark Mansfield. I'm the National Sales Manager of Cutwater Boats. And we're here at the Toronto Boat Show, uh, and we're with Hearst Marina, and we're excited to represent and bring out to you the new Cutwater Boats. Here at this show, we have a 26, a 28, and the exciting new 30. It's an exciting new brand. It's pocket cruisers that are diesel. So we created a hull that's never been done in the industry before. This hull actually has a bulbous bow. It's got a keel to it, reverse chines, and then it's also got a stepped hull. This is kind of unique. In the early spring or the late fall, early in the morning, you can close this in because your engine is located underneath here. But as the day gets warmer, <clears throat> we can open up the glass door and we can also open up the hatch. So all of a sudden you have now more of an open door, all one level, all the way forward to the master stateroom. So right here, you have a side out seat and basically you just lift this handle, pull it up, and set your cushion up on top. And then you have seating for two more people back in the boat. And you can see you don't have to carry deck chairs with it because we can seat seven people in this cockpit. So two on the other side, similar seat just like this. We have a seat here in the bulkhead because we've raised the window up. So here's another seat. And then there's two in the reversible seat in the back end. So you can see, you can sit here and you got a lot of room. You don't have to move tables and move chairs just to be social, maybe on the water on the hook or sitting at the dockside. Usable space and functional space is so important in boats these days. So what we have here is a full dinette, as you can see, your table in the middle. Of course, if you're cruising, you got nice handrails, cup holders. Another real benefit is the space that we have available. So here is a mid stateroom boat that's underneath the hull because the hull is built so big but this is a nice place for storage or two people to stay on the boat when you're with it in today's world a lot of people want the galley up so the benefit here is there's your 12 volt refrigerator and freezer this is a stove and oven that can be either propane or electric large sink very nice drawers with dovetails on the side, made just like your home. And then here's a forward seat. But we can change this. Just pull this up, move this over, and you've got a nice lounge, but you also have an area right here. So the whole galley top comes down and it gets hidden away for the evening when you're gonna maybe bring out some appetizers and drinks. In the salon, you also have a 12 volt wine cooler that holds six bottles, and that is standard. We're now at the helm, and you can see right away, the seat is still for the dinette. But this is an easy conversion, where you just twist it and bring it up here, and now you've got double white seating sitting at the helm. Very, very yachtish looking helm. You have two displays by the Garmin 7212s, bow thrusters and stern thrusters that are standard on the side. Your windlass and spotlight are standard. Electronic controls, your VHF is standard. Solid wood wheel is standard. Compass, defrosters. So you got a very well equipped helm area. Now we enter into the uh, stateroom of the Cutwater 30. You got a little bit of storage combined around and then storage underneath the V-berth. We're gonna have four hatches, another hatch here, two hatches above, so you get a lot of ventilation. If you order the air conditioning option, the forward stateroom is gonna have its own air conditioning unit right up here. Very unique to the Cutwater 30 is gonna be its head and shower. They're actually separate, so when you're taking a shower, you're enclosed in a cylinder and the water's not gonna cover on top of your head. The D6, an electronic engine by Volvo, and we actually use the 370 and sometimes the optional 435. It's very compact, as you can see, but these engines were designed for the marine industry. These are cast iron directly from Volvo, and this is where you have access, you can see, to your oil pumps, to all your uh, 
strainers, they're all accessible right here. Your pumps are accessible here also. The neat thing about these engines, you're allowed to plant your feet right on top of them as they are designed for the marine industry. Right behind us is the optional generator. That's a 5KW Onan. So a lot of exciting things, very efficient. It's almost kind of like a smart boat, but it's giving you the things you want as a boater.